Hey guys, what's up? It's Alex Jeweler Help, and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to fix the mobile substrate issue after installing a current port of Siri, like I mean the GUI, and by the port, I mean a tweak um, like Siri Night or H1 Siri or Siri Rain or any of those uh, that you have installed. So basically, once you install that, uh, you will notice that none of your mobile substrate add-ons work. So your SB settings won't work and even if you go into settings and scroll down you won't see any of your jailbreak tabs and so yeah so in this video I'm going to show you how to fix that so as you can see I, current, I do have a port of Siri currently in my iPod touch so yeah as you can see right there Sorry, I but so yeah so anyway in this video I'm going to be showing you how to fix that so it's actually a pretty simple fix. The only thing that you need to do is actually reinstall an item. So what you want to do is open Obsidia. And I'm going to cancel this. And then you want to go into the search tab and just search for mobile substrate. Uh, actually it's separated right there mobile substrate and just click on it and you wanna be clicking modify reinstall and click confirm and after you install it you will wanna reboot so um, since iOS 5 has a tether jailbreak we will be booting via red snow so why don't we put our device into DFU mode? So 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let go of the power button, keep holding home. So that should be good. And so now uh, let's hop to our computer and we'll be open up, opening up Red Snow to boot tethered. So here is Red Snow. Uh, then basically just click on Extra, select type is W, and point it to the 5.0 firmware. Click OK. And since our device is in DFU mode, we don't have to worry about that. Just click Just Boot, and it'll and it'll automatically go to the um, exploding with Lime Rain and all that good stuff. So it's now it's basically gonna boot tethered. So as you can see right there, my iPod Touch is booting up tethered. So that's good. And after your device boots up, uh, you'll eventually see that if you try to uh, toggle these settings um, or in, any of your jailbreak tweaks, they will eventually work. And if you go into settings, all your tabs will be there. So as you can see, there's activator and the tab for Siri. So yeah, as you can see, it works. And so yeah, that's pretty much the fix. And yeah. So thank you guys for watching this video, hope you did enjoy it, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe up there. And I guess that's it, I'll catch you in the next video.